Good morning, Zert Nation, XP001. Thanks for kicking it with me this morning. Um, today I want to talk about um, EMPs, electronic magnetic pulse. I know there's a lot of um, a lot of you preppers out there and a lot of guys that um, actually taking this into consideration. Um, the reason I'm talking about today is, believe it or not, I was actually talking with uh, one of my buddies, he's active duty um, in an SF unit, and they're actually doing contingency planning and looking at uh, gear to, um, you know, what is it, the, the Faraday cage, right? Um, to store stuff, but the thing is, if you look at it, what if that happens while you're out and about, right? And, you know, you're not at your home and you're in between and civil unrest kicks off. Basically what it comes down to is all your electronic shit, that stuff's done. So what it makes me think about is all of us are running optics on our rifles, we all have flashlights, right? So what it comes down to, if that's all done, it really, which my buddy was saying, they're really going back to the basics. So it's basically, hey, uh, touching up and uh, getting refreshed back on running iron sights on your rifle, because your optics gonna be shit. Um, also, too, if you don't have a flashlight, what are improvised me methods, you know, chem lights? Uh, two, if your GPS, your phones, you know, for them on an operational level, if they're out in operation and an EMP does hit, their GPS, satellite, everything's done, so they have to revert back to, you know, basic land nav, compass and, and map reading. So a few, little, few things that kind of uh, you should take into consideration. Uh, it made my mind wander a little bit when I was talking with them. Um, but other than that, so for all you guys, uh, you know, that are concerned about EMPs, you know, uh, or everyone, everyone should, you know, pra always practice with your iron sights and maybe have some um, uh, Kim lights in your go bag and maybe go old school and have a, a topographical map of your area and, and a compass. So thanks for tuning in. XP001, out. Zert's mission is to support law abiding Zert, citizens okay. taking their skills to the next level. We provide training opportunities and a wealth of knowledge via Zert's global network of like-minded individuals. Each Zert member can take it as far as they wish to go. You can take part in Zert training, Zert online training, network with individuals in your area via the forums or private Facebook pages, attend meet and greets in your state or county, or have fun collecting the unique gear Zert has to offer. We have members from all walks of life and our emphasis is on creating a safe, fun and mature community for all involved. When you think of Zert, consider the term lifestyle. Lifestyle can denote the interests, opinions, behaviors, and behavioral orientations of an individual, group, or culture. By definition, Zert is a lifestyle. Zert's instructor cadre is made up of special forces instructors who use their vast knowledge and real-world experience to teach civilian members. Zert's goal is to elevate the level of education and safety in the training industry. ZERT is not just an organization. It's a lifestyle. ZERTNation.com